Hey guys, Bob here from Raw Strength and Muscle, and we are going to discuss my six week results on the Explosive Muscle Program. For those who haven't been paying attention, I released my most recent workout and diet in the Raw Strength and Muscle Brotherhood on the 20th of January. And I fattened myself up a little bit so I could go through the transformation with you guys, and I've been logging it every week. So I started on December the 20th at 209.2 pounds. Now today, the 31st of January, exactly six weeks later, I weighed 192.3 pounds. So in total, I lost 16.9 pounds. I went from a 37 inch waist to an exactly 33 inch waist this morning, which is down four inches in my waist in six weeks. Now, as I always do, I compare my progress, not just from the start, but also from the last week. So let's look at what happened in the last seven days. Okay, I lost 1.2 pounds since last week. Not very much at all, okay? As a matter of fact, the week before last, I lost 6.4 pounds in a week. And the very first week that I was on this, I lost like almost 10 pounds, it was like nine point whatever. So basically the reason why I break it down like this is so you can see that weight loss does not occur in a linear fashion. You don't lose one pound or two pounds or five or 10 pounds a week every single week. I dropped a lot of slop weight the first week that I was on the diet and the workout. You know, just a bunch of garbage in my stomach, started fiber, water, you know, getting really healthy again. I just fleshed out a lot of garbage out of my body. 10 pounds one week. And then I lost a couple pounds, a couple pounds, a couple pounds. Like I said, the week before last, I lost, what was it, uh, 6.4 pounds in one week. Okay, another jump. And this week, I only lost 1.2 pounds. Not very much. Okay, respectable, but not very much. However, I lost three quarters of an inch from my waist over the last seven days. Okay, compare that to the week before when I lost 6.4 pounds, I lost a half of an inch. So I lost more waist size, more body fat this last week than the week before, although I lost a lot more weight on the scale the week before. And once again, the reason I'm blogging this every single week is so you guys can see this. A lot of people get frustrated. You know, they lose a lot of weight and then they don't lose weight or, you know, something happens where they think they're not really progressing. You've got to wake up first thing in the morning, use the toilet, measure your waist, measure your body weight before you eat or drink anything. You have to do it all at the same time on the same day, okay? Because in one day, you might just gain five pounds of water. Like at the end of the day, I'm gonna have a one inch bigger waist and I'm gonna weigh five pounds more almost every single day. That's just the way it is. So you have to keep things stable. Every single week, it has to be exactly at the same time after you've used the toilet, before you've eaten or drunk anything every single week. Another thing is measure your waist because if you watch some of these episodes, you'll see. You know, last week I lost a lot of weight on the scale and I lost, you know, what was it, half of an inch um, from my waist. This week I only lost like a little bit over a pound from the scale, but I actually lost three quarters of an inch from my waist. So I am making progress, okay? You know, this is what's gonna happen if you're doing a good diet and a good workout, you're gonna recompose your body. You're gonna be consistently losing body fat, but you might not always be losing weight on the scale AKA perfect reason why you have to make sure that you measure your waist all the time and that you look at this over a, a consistent basis, okay? Not how much did I lose last week or yesterday. Look, how much did I lose over a period of time? Because like I said, even if I lost one and a half you know, pounds this week, or what was it, 1.2 pounds last week, Considering the week I lost over six pounds, the week I lost almost 10 pounds, it averages out to, you know, let's see, uh, 17 pounds in six weeks. That's like three pounds a week, a little bit less than three pounds a week. Very respectable and aggressive, but a decent rate at which to lose weight. So anyway, let's go ahead and check out the video of my physique check-in. Uh, like I said, 192.3 pounds and a 33 inch waist this morning. My goal is still to get down to a sub 31 inch waist. 
still looking at getting down to around 180. So it's another, you know, 12, 13 pounds I have to lose. Uh, considering five pounds of fat that I lose is usually one inch from my waist. If I get down to 180, I should be under a 31 inch waist. So two more inches around my waist plus a little bit to go. We'll see how it works out. Anyway, here's what I was looking like this morning. 